welcome to my new youtube channel which is going to be about literally i don't know but today is the first video which is going to be about the new m2 macbook air yeah the one that came out july I don't boy know it literally I came out july the boxing channel Ooh, do i have information on here nope you guys can't see that what do i do do i just like boy if you don't okay anyway specs uh i got the base model i'm a student i'm not gonna edit unless i like become like youtube famous man i got the let me read to you guys this is the only thing i know about okay eight unified memory whatever that is i think that's like how many tabs you can have at once and then 256 gigabytes of solid state drive why are mouses so expensive that's the one thing i want to know because it's, it's like a mouse like what does it do that's so special so also co-star guest my brother he's just here doing random stuff well i'm unboxing this so and there's people. so now we're at a new camera angle i know it's like not the best but we're gonna have to do with what we have it's about to fall also i heard this i heard it's supposed to be really like light so it already feels extremely light and there's a new design this whole thing's a new design totally new okay this part's satisfying hold on see this oh crap that's not how you're supposed to do it <laughs> wait Ugh, i totally ruined that um like the other unboxing channels let me just put this to the side and look what's inside so the first thing we have is this new charging cable boy that's, that's a charging oh, block like ain't no way this i call like that the, a charging called, cable the iPad one. why is it so small i know there's other options and stuff but that is sad <laughs> basically this is a new charger it also matches the new midnight color um it's extremely like the design is so nice like it's extremely flat oh gosh i'm holding it the wrong way there we go also i heard that it picks up fingerprints like extremely well which is not necessarily like a bad thing i mean it kind of is for most people but for me i don't really mind to get this one anyway this is i i've already unboxed this but you know why not add it to the thing look man it's so cool uh, ignore the fingerprints i know it's bad but it matches the new midnight color black and also the new macbook kind of looks like from different angles hold on let me show you guys well i have good lighting right now but like if you see it in the dark it's it looks like it's black so like the mouse would actually match it also you know the cable the guy that matched the cable too i don't think we have to charge it right away i think it comes pre-charged or whatever hold on i'm hold on mm, okay good okay guys it's here i didn't see it though look it matches that's actually so nice down below what you guys use your apple stickers for because uh <laughs> i love apple stickers but i've never used them like anywhere i have i have them for my phone i have them for ipads i just never used it so comment down below what you guys use your apple stickers for let's change views now hey guys so um after a day of having the new m2 macbook air i actually tested out a few things compared to my old m1 macbook air and i have a few differences i've noticed the one thing i kind of find annoying is the new notch and i don't think the notch is annoying i think like the way it interacts with the system it kind of interferes and it i don't mean, get used to it you know but it'll take a while compared to the other one like this one just kind of messes the browsing experience up i don't know uh next also i feel like the keyboard feels kind of cheap but i don't know i don't know maybe it's just me i mean it's fine i don't really care but compared to my other one the m1 it feels different i guess i don't know also um the build design's nice it has like problems like that solid state drive so I mean, I don't notice it, but once you start doing heavy tasks and running a bunch of stuff on it, it probably will start slowing down. But I will try that out later. Um, but honestly, for just daily browsing and stuff, like doing schoolwork, I don't think it really matters. Uh, but overall, I feel like it's obviously like a pretty good MacBook for its price as well. Uh, but you know, if you're trying to go between M1, M2, Honestly, I would probably stick with the M1. Only, I mean, it's preference. You get the new design and everything for this one, but you're not gonna really notice it. And I tried the camera. It's, I mean, I just wanna say that. Uh, totally your opinion on which one you wanna buy. It doesn't really matter. Each one's pretty good, but it does depend on what you're doing. For me personally, I'm doing schoolwork and that's pretty much it, so. Anyways, guys, thank you for tuning into this horrific unboxing experience. I know it was bad, 
but it was my first one so i mean you can't really can't really judge off of that i will try at least to get better at videos um for now this is my first video and it will forever be um definitely a memory we'll see you guys in the next video if i i don't know if i'm gonna make another but if i do see you guys then bye